for your kind words. God is good. And all the time. Now permit me to invite our former president, His Excellency Oro Kenyatta. To address the congregation and give his message of congratulations. Your Excellency, welcome. Your Excellency, the Apostolic Nuncio, Your Eminence, Cardinal Njue, Your Grace, Archbishop Philip Pagnolo, Your Graces, my Lord Bishops, the clergy, all leaders here present, Yangu ya kwanza ni kuchukua nafasi hii kuwapongeza mabishop wetu wapya na kuwa na nafasi ya officially saying my lord bishop bwana kamomoe and my lord bishop nganga Asa wamepata title lingine kwa hivyo ni vizuri nikisema hivyo. Congratulations and we wish you every success and you are in our prayers. Niseme ya kwamba tuko na furaha kuwa pamoja nanyi siku ya leo. Ikiwa ni siku ya kusherehekea na kurudisha uh, shukran kwa Mwenyezi Mungu kwa kutufikisha hapa. Na ndipo kila siku tunasema Mungu ni mwema na Mungu hutenda mema. Na wakati wa kila mtu Mungu amempangia. Leo imefika ni wakati ya Father Kamomoe na Father Wainaina kuacha jina. <laughs> Father Nganga Pole ne jolide. <laughs> Kuacha jina father na sasa kuitwa bishop. Todo mudanyo ni gwa mava kiro ne gai. Na ni gwa wao. Na ni kyo hede shiwa tu gwa gai ne moega. Yangu tu ni kusema. Ya kwamba. Wameingia hii kazi leo. Kusaidiana na wenzao haswa Archbishop Anyolo Kueneza injili katika diocese yetu ya Nairobi Na hiyo sio kazi ambayo tutasema ni raisi kwa sababu dunia ambayo tunaishi yaendelea kuwa ngumu na ikiwa ngumu saa ingine watu hupotea na wakipotea wanatafuta mchungaji na mchungaji ni yule ambaye atasikiliza wale ambao wanaongoza na badala ya kuwaeleza ni kushauriana pamoja na wao apate suluhu ya kuwasaidia katika shida zao we have for too long sometimes Taken leadership to mean your capacity to lord it over everybody else. But as the nuncio has reminded us today, the job of a shepherd is not to direct, but to guide and lead and bring everybody along with you. To meskia juu ya wasaliti 
Nunsi wametuambia hapa mambo ya wasaliti. Na ajichunge wasaliti wa kanisa. Mabishop mujichunge. Lakini mimi nataka niseme hii. Nikiangalia to my left, to my right. Sio ni shida ya usaliti mwingi sana huku. Hawa ni watu ukiwaongelesha vizuri mtapelekana na hawa vizuri sana na watawasaidia kwa kazi zenu. Usaliti huko upande mwingine staki sikio. Usaliti ni mwingi sana. Lakini kwa wasaliti tunawaambia hata Judas alisaliti Yesu lakini hiyo mahela aliiwacha akaenda akatafuta kamba. Kwa hivyo Yoshiragwa because ya mwishine dare. Kuna siku ambaye haina mwisho wake. So yangu ni kusema shirikianeni pamoja na hawa. Bring them into your confidence. Bring them into your trust. They especially in difficult times will help guide you through and bring your flock to greener pastures. There was once a man who said, Yakwamba, the church is the conscience of society. We must always ask ourselves, and especially the leadership of the church, is whether we are still faithful to that calling. Are we still the conscience of society? Or have we forgotten that critical role? In times of difficulty, that consciousness is very important. And I pray that the Lord God will guide our two new bishops, that they will remain that conscience, that they will speak their minds in the interest of their people without fear or favor, knowing that it is their mission to not only preach the gospel and teach, but also to practically walk and live with those that they shepherd through their difficult times and to stand for them when their people need it. It is servant leadership, not leadership to be served. I wish God's grace, I wish God's blessings, I also wish God's joy for you as you move forward. I congratulate your parents. Moloradi muna ni joy. Korosi ya nyune shiwi ila nage kia no muda nya wawo muthi. Mwone te shia na shia. Mashimi wa Rais Mustafu Uhuru Mwega Ikinyata na waombea baraka wazazi kwa hawa mbao. Ni wazazi wa maskofu wate ule. Na tunu wa shukuru hata njini wazazi. Kwa zawadien. wazazi kwa familia kwa kushikilia hawa wenzetu tuwasema asante tuwasema Mungu aendelee kuibariki taifa letu la Kenya Mungu aendelee kubariki wananchi wetu wa Kenya tuendelee kuwa na umoja tuendelee kupendana na kanisa ishike jukumu lake la kuhakikisha ya kwamba imetetea haki za wananchi wa taifa hili letu la Kenya. Mungu na wabariki na waweke. Asante. Thank you very much, Your Excellency. Now allow me to invite the speaker of the